Hello and welcome to this Ham Radio Unlimited Quickie. Today we're going to show you how you can sign up to get your DMR ID or your CC7 uh, ID, some people call it. And we're doing this today because we're coming up in a couple of videos. We're going to talk about hotspots and we're going to need to have a DMR ID if you want to set up DMR. So this is a really quick how to get your own DMR ID. First of all, you go to radioid.net. You see that right up here in the address bar. And I'll put a link to that down in the description as well. And when you get here, you may get a cookie notice. Just uh, answer that. But after you get that, you come down here to sign up and register. And you're going to see this blinking thing down here. And it basically says, I will not register a new call sign when you already have an account or DMR ID. Register a repeater under its own account or register on the site unless you are a licensed amateur radio operator. So assuming you are all of that, what we're going to do is check this I agree box and we're going to click on register account. Now I already have a radio ID so I can't uh, can't get one but basically what you would do is you put your call sign in here. I'm going to go ahead and fill it out. K3DO and my email. K3DO.com Oh yeah, you see right here it's telling you that I already have it. So yeah, that's okay. Um, and then your password here and then you pick the your territory, click the uh, I am not a robot button, and you create an account. And really, it's that simple. Um, at the time of this recording, they were asking for a copy of your license. You could just email them the PDF from the FCC site. But I'm not sure they're still doing that anymore. So, if, But if that happens, you send it in. It doesn't take very long. Uh, it generally takes, it can take up to 24 hours, sometimes maybe 48 hours, depending if it's the weekend. But sometimes it only takes a few minutes, so it all depends on who's watching and checking things out. But that's it. That is today's short. Uh, you, after you get your, your number, we'll can move forward with the other videos if you came here for that reason. But this is how you get your DMR ID. It's really simple these days. Be sure to uh, like and subscribe down below. We definitely would appreciate that. And we'll see you in the upcoming videos where we talk more about DMR. <laughs>